Oh, what is up YouTube? I'm back again. I know another video, an actual consistent time. So I'm going to try to post videos on Sunday, but today we're going to do something a little different. I've been playing a lot of GeoGuessr. I started watching GeoWizard because I saw Ludwig make a video about GeoWizard and it's been a lot of fun. So we're going to play that today. It's going to be kind of a long video, but I'm going to try to limit it to 30 minutes. I feel like that's enough time to like narrow down the place, but also get a good number of points. So let me show you how many games I've played so far and how I've done. And mind you, I had help from my friends before this. So this is my first time doing it alone, really. So, all right. So here we, um, I just got a pro membership today because I don't want to wait 24 hours. I've completed four games. My very best game with my friends was 21,000 points, and the maximum amount of points you can get is 25,000. Our best round was 5,000 points, pretty much right on the money. And let's see, our average game is 15,000 points. Fair warning, I'm really bad at geography. <laughs> like, I'm really bad at geography. And yeah. So let's see how it goes. Okay, so we're gonna go and play the entire world and see how that goes. So let's get into it. Let's add some music just to make it a little, you know, nicer. All right, I'm gonna play the world and we're gonna do time limit of six minutes. That's gonna be about 30 minutes. And we'll, we'll do moving. Cool. All right. Let's get into it. Okay, great. So we're uh, starting off in a nice little neighborhood. Uh, let's see. What? What? Um, okay. Let's see. Uh, this, this could be in the United States. This could be literally anywhere let's try to find something to help us out a little bit okay there's a red stop sign cool and this is in english deborah drive and what is that jennifer lane okay that's not it's not too helpful we can't narrow down too much there i want to say this is in the u.s so what we're going to try to do now is figure out a major road and hopefully that can lead us to a highway which can then narrow down the state I like I said I don't know anything about geography so this is gonna be tough and we also have a timer so yeah gotta gotta move kind of quick here let's see um, I hope this leads to a highway we saw the speed limit was 35. Makes sense, it's a residential area. All right, where the heck is a highway? Wow, I wanna say this is the Midwest, but I have no idea, not a single clue. Please just take me to a major road. All right, uh, okay, okay. Pa Pahagago Road and Lake Road. Still not that helpful. Hopefully, we can find something. Alright. Please, someone, anyone. Oh my gosh. This is awful. I just need a highway. Wait, why do we keep seeing this red car? That's so weird. Um, all right. Three minutes now? Oh, geez. Wait, what does that say? Ken Myers Photography. Still not that helpful. Oh, gosh. Ken Myers. Wait, can we not even move? Oh, okay, there we go. That was weird. Little bug. Oh, God. What? What is up with this road? This road is so long. Oh my gosh. 
I'm so far from the start. Oh wait, what does it say? Susagana River. Does that say Bowling Green? Oh gosh, I can't read the sign. It's too blurry. Bunch Green. Okay. I still don't know where that is. I'm assuming it's where in the US. I need I need something more concrete. Let's see. Oh man, time is ticking. I'm stressed. Alright, alright. Maybe this. Trees cheap 717. Oh, I also don't know any area codes, but based on the digits, we know we're in the US, which is good. Kind of. Okay, State Road 3092, Corporal Luke. Okay, so let's go to North America. Here. Ah, uh, what does this say? State Road. Oh, fudge. Fudge! Alright. Wait, I missed it. Where does the sign go? What the heck? Oh, the sign. State Road 92. 92. Uh, is that is it gonna be a small one? Okay, 98? Are these state roads? Oh god. Oh god. There's a minute left. No pressure, no pressure. 98. Oh god, oh god. 92. Oh, wait, 92. Maybe? Possibly? What else was it? 92? Oh, it was 30. 92. Okay, wait, this is 3000s. Um. Uh. Oh god. Oh god, there's already a minute left. Would it, would it be forward of me to think we're in, uh, what, what state is that? Louisiana? I, I have no idea. I don't even know which part of Louisiana. Alright, I'm gonna drop a pin just in case we run out of time. I wanna say... 31... Yeah, I, I don't know. This is, this is tough. And this is, the map is a whole entire world, as you can see right here, so. I mean, we we're kind of lucky we're in the US, because I know a little bit more about the US than anything else, but not enough. Alright. Yeah, let's, let's just guess. Wow, we were pretty far. This is all the way in Maryland. Right outside of York. Okay. Okay, 30, now there's State Road 3092. All right, that was, that was a rough start. Let's see if we can do any better. That honestly might just be our best score this whole game. All right, we are, oh yeah, 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 the longitude. Uh, uh huh, what language is this? Is this Spanish? Oh, what a cute little car. All right. Um, we need we need some clues. We're looking for some street signs right now. Anything, something, anything would help. Let's see. Let's see. Wait, there's a sign. There's a sign. Okay. Pasen Pasenia. Okay, we're in a Spanish-speaking country. For sure. Let's see. Okay, I don't, I don't speak any Spanish. I actually don't speak any languages other than English. I do understand some Tagalog because my parents are Filipino and I'm Filipino, but let's keep looking. Yeah, it still isn't helpful. There's so many Latin speaking or Spanish speaking countries flag maybe can we get a flag any flags in this uh google map thing no no 
Man. I know Mr. Worldwide, aka Pitbull, is from Miami, but I have no idea where we are. A single clue. Oh my gosh. This is, this is, a. Uh... This is not a great showing. Okay, there's a Pentecostal church. Oh, Bolivia. Okay, okay. I think we're in Bolivia. What does it say? Uh, the church, Pentecostal church, United Bolivia. Okay, whatever. We're, we're just gonna go with it. So we're in Bolivia. Where's Bolivia? There's Bolivia. I, I totally knew where it was. Okay. Countries, kind of big, not that bad. So let's, let's just drop a pin here, just in case we forget or run out of time for whatever reason. Bolivia is, I mean, out of the whole country, you have to try and figure out where we are. So right now we're looking for a sign that gives the city away. Nazareth. Centro de Spiritual Dictad. Okay, center of... Spirituality and formation. Okay. I wasted like 30 seconds reading that sign. Uh, and we're no closer to narrowing down where in Bolivia we are. Oh my gosh. Maybe this sign? No, no, no. None of these signs are helpful. I, I'm going so far away from the start that. No idea where we are. Oh, wait. Okay. What the heck? Okay. All right. All right. Is that a sign? Please. Something. Anything. No. Nope. No. Where are we? Watch it not even be Bolivia. I, I just might cry. Do, 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 do. Edgar Montano. Okay, all right. A truck. Okay, usually trucks give like a little bit of a hint but not here. Let's see. Okay, that food looks kind of good. What is this? Station, a service station. Ramirez. That's not the name of a city. Unfortunately. Well, it could be. Actually, I, I don't know. Like I said, I know nothing about these other countries. Okay. Yeah. I definitely will believe that we're in Bolivia, somewhere. Okay, chicken. Um. Well, well, well. Yeah, I'm just gonna go back to the start and try to. Oh, wow, we could make this full screen. I've. Ha. <laughs> Yeah, I, I knew that. Totally. Totally knew that. Yup. Okay. We're gonna have to we're gonna have to use some clues here. What do we see around us? A lot of green. Though, there is a lot of green in Bolivia. This could be anywhere. Yet again, are these mountains? I have 10 seconds. All right, I'm just, that, that seems like a good spot, right? All right, okay. All right, let's guess. Wow, okay, pretty good. Wow, my original pin was like up here. So it's near Santa Cruz, 4,000 points. I'll take it. Shout out to that sign. Okay, all right. There's a sign already. Great, we're off to a great start. That language? looks Greek yeah let's let's go with that I also don't know too much about languages could be Russian no clue 
literally the only things I can distinguish are Japanese characters, Korean characters, and sometimes Chinese characters. All that anime paying off. But yeah, we, we could still be anywhere. All right, so what we're gonna try to do is we're gonna try and find a major highway. Or anything that says the name of a city. If I can understand. I wanna say this is Greek. But it's okay, we have time. We have five minutes. Because we wasted a minute just uh, to, yeah, I don't even know what we wasted that minute on. What the heck? Um, any cities? Any cities? Uh, no, no, no cities. Honestly, I would. I actually need a country first because even if you gave me the name of a city here, I wouldn't know what country we're in. So let's see. Is there any highways? Any? What does this bus say? No, there's nothing on the bus. I can give us a hint. Even if they gave me a landmark, I probably wouldn't know what country we're in still. Alright, let's see. There's a sale. Seems like a pretty good deal, I think. TV. 9,000, whatever that is. Okay. All right, I'm getting a little discouraged, I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, I, uh, this is tough, it's real tough. So assuming that this is Greek, right? Would we be in Greece? I don't need, where's Greece on the map? I wasn't kidding when I said I'm bad at geography. Greece. It's in Europe, right? Greek? Greece? This is somewhere near Europe? There, there's Greece. Yeah, yeah. All right. Wait. Okay. This seems, this seems Greek. Or this could be... Well, wow, this could be any of these countries. All of these things look the same to me. Like Greek. Serbia. Bulgaria, they all, all these characters look the same. Yeah. All right. We're just gonna keep looking. We're just gonna keep looking for a major highway. Hopefully gives a little more insight to which country we're in. Anything? No, no, okay. All right. Uh, no, no. Alright, we're gonna turn back to the start. I have no idea where we were. We were just super far away from everything. Uh... So, funny story. I put a time limit because me and my friend were playing in Japan. And neither of us have been to Japan. We spent so long trying to pinpoint exactly where we were. We spent about an hour on one round. And I don't want to make this a two hour video just to get all five rounds. So that's why there's a time limit. And that's why I'd be happy if we broke 10,000 points, to be honest. Wait, wait, I, I skimmed over that. Does it say anything? Please, no. No. Oh gosh. It's a 24 hour far thing. What country is this? I just need to know. Okay. Alright. We're running out of time. So let's use the sun. As there the sun's not even here. Wait, is this the sun? Is this east?
we might be in Bulgaria? Maybe? Are we by the water? That could also give us a huge clue. That's where we are. Whether we're more inland or not. Wait, what is this huge sign? Is this a billboard? Or is this just a piece of wood? Wait, does that say the country on it? No. No, it doesn't. Oh my gosh. Well, no. Let, let's go Greece. Let's go in between. Closer to Bulgaria. What? This was in Russia. Oh man, that's... Oh. We're at 7,000. And we have two rounds left. Okay. Oh, there's a flag. I don't, I don't know what flag that is. There's, what, what? What is this? There's a Canadian flag. Oh, Toronto. Okay, cool. Fruily. Really? Yeah, yeah, okay. So we're in Toronto. I've never been to Canada either. So where's Toronto? Um, okay, there's Toronto. Oh, we found it. Yeah. All right. So we're here. In Toronto. More specifically. Fruily Court. All right. And? Islington Avenue. All right. What is this thing called? Fruily Entree. Toronto? Okay. We're, we're off to a good start. We're, we're gonna need something more though. I will drop a pin here in Toronto. Oh, I'm covering it. I'm so sorry. Wait. There. There. Yeah, there. There's the pin. Okay. Let's put it there. Actually, move it. We're going to try to find a highway now. Now that we know we're in Toronto. Area code. You need a highway. Steelers. Like the football team? Kidding. Kidding. Welcome to Toronto, Ontario's capital. Wow, wow, that's, that's really helpful. All right, we are Islington Ave. I need like something more concrete. We pull up our map. We need we need something like, I guess we don't need a highway per se. I guess we can use the street names, I guess. I guess we can try looking for that. What street are we on? We're near Steele's Ave. Oh wait, wait, we're more specifically in Vaughn, York region. Okay, this is good. This is good. York, this is York. And we're in Vaughn. Vaughn. Uh. Vaughn. Where? I have three minutes left. Okay. Vaughn. York is kind of big. Are we in which part of York? Are we? Oh, there's Vaughn. There's Vaughn. Okay, so we're in Vaughn. Cool. Cool. We're somewhere here. Okay. What is that? And we're near the Fruilly Center, which is. So we're also on Steele's Avenue. In Vaughn. Steele's Avenue. Steele's Avenue. How big is Vaughn? Steel's Avenue. We need we need something. Is Fruilly Center gonna show up on here? Fruilly Center. Hmm. Hmm. Alright, I will drop a pin somewhere near Vaughn. Just in case we run out of time because we're distracted. Steel's Avenue. Where's our pen? Oh, there's our pen. Okay. Steel's Avenue. Hmm. Hmm. 
Interesting, interesting. I am... Wow. We're so close, but also so far. Okay, so we're, we're back to start. We're on Islington Ave. We're right off Islington Ave and the Fruilly Center. So Islington Ave, Islington Ave. Where is Islington Ave? Islington Avenue. It seems like a pretty long street, I want to say. It does seem pretty long. So. So we're in Vaughn, Islington Ave. What? Where is this? Why is it so hard? We're so close yet so far. Islington Avenue, please. Please. We already know what's in Vaughn. What is this thing called? It's called the Fruilly Center. Fruilly Center. Free, Fruilly. The village at Vaughn Mills. Wait, how big is Vaughn? Is Vaughn all of this? Is this all Vaughn? Oh my gosh. We might have gotten ahead of ourselves. Dang it. Oh well. It doesn't, doesn't hurt. We're gonna get, oh, oh, 6.9 miles. 49.63, I'll take it, I'll take it. We beat our quota of 10,000. So that's not too bad. It's not too bad at all. All right, okay. All right, characters, yes. Is this Chinese? Oh geez, oh geez, I, I don't know. I don't know. Oh god. Is this Japanese? I need I need something more. I don't I don't know the difference in characters. I'm so sorry. I thought I did. I wanna go out on a limb and say this is somewhere in Japan. So what we're gonna do, real quick, is we're gonna drop a pin in Japan. Somewhere in Japan, hopefully. And we're gonna try and find a highway right now. Oh, this could literally be anywhere. Oh, this is so cute, look at this. We have an eggplant and I don't, what is this green thing? I don't know. But, <laughs> that's so cute. You don't see stuff like that in America. I don't think. I could be wrong again. But you don't just see mascots of uh, fruit. All right, so we're trying to find a major highway to give us a little more idea of a city. Okay, all right. What? Does that just say Family Mart? It does. Ah, uh, gosh. Okay, wait. This is this is good. We're getting closer to a highway of sorts, maybe. Okay, this would. This seems not the way. Where would a highway be? It's all residential areas. Family Mart. Family Mart. Ah, oh, jeez. I feel like a dumb American. Where are we? Oh, jeez. How much time do we have left here? Three minutes. All right. So we have narrowed it down to a country. Hopefully. Hopefully it's the right country. 
It's definitely an Asian country. Panasonic. Is this is this the right way to a highway? Are we gonna wait? There's a sign. Where's the sign? Yes, yes. Okay, we're near Oita, Nakatsu, and Honya. Bakai. Okay. Are any of those major cities? Nakatsu, Oita. No. So we are still lost. Anything here? Oh wait, Oita. So we're here. I think. Somewhere here. If we zoom in a little bit more. Central Nakatsu? Where's Nakatsu on the map? It's Nakatsu. Oh jeez. Oh jeez. Wait, 663? So what my friend and I figured out is we uh, call them guitar picks or hexagons. So these these would be hexagons. And then these other things would be guitar, guitar picks. So we're near 663 and 675. Oh, okay. Wait, are we in... No, Oita's... Why is there Oita up here? Oh wait, this these are the characters. Okay, cool. So 663... 675 Wait, are those the characters? They are, they are, okay. 663675 I, I can't find it. I can't seem to find it. What? What is this? Alright, I'm just gonna drop a pin somewhere near Oita. Because if I recall correctly... Hita Honyo... Alright, return to start. Yeah, okay. 663 and 675. Wait, where did I drop my pin? Wait, this doesn't seem that city down, so like, let's say here. Alright. Hope for the best. Okay! Wow! Nice! It was... Wait, where were we? It's actually all the way up here. In... Oh, well, there's 663. The highway right here that we were looking for. That's pretty good. 34 miles. I'll, I'll take that. Overall, we got 16,709. This was the first game of the day. Let's look at a breakdown. So, let me move this over a little bit. Oh, not that. We're going to move this one. So here. We got first round, round one. Where were we? We were so far off. It was actually in Maryland. Round two. Wait, that's round four. What? Where was round two? Was that Bolivia? Okay, round two was Bolivia. Got pretty close. Now round three took us for a little whirl because I didn't know the language. It was actually Russian and not Bulgarian. Then round four and five, we went ham. We got Ontario. We almost got a perfect score. We were 6.9 miles away. And then lastly, in Japan. Wait, where's Japan? Okay, there it is. Almost couldn't find it. We were pretty close. 34 miles away. All right. We're going to move this back down. And that's going to conclude the video. Thanks so much for watching. I have a lot of fun playing GeoGuessr. And if you think you can score better, well, leave a comment down below and give this video a like. So I know you guys enjoyed it. Hopefully I make some more GeoGuessr videos in the future. And we're going to return to Valheim soon. My friend just had some complications, lost all his stuff, but 
that's that. And I plan on uploading every Sunday, so I will see you guys next Sunday. Peace.